Newly appointed ministers in the reshuffled cabinet lineup are eager to accept the new challenge and start their respective jobs soon. Amana leader Dr Zulkifli Ahmad thanked Anwar Ibrahim for his reappointment as health minister and said he's ready to bounce back after a hiatus. Azalina Uthman Said, who is retained as the Law and Institutional Reform Minister, thanked Anwar and his deputy Ahmad Zaid Hamadi for their trust in letting her keep her job. Former Deputy Education Minister Lim Hu Ying, who has been moved to Deputy Finance Minister, also thanked Anwar and vowed to do her level best in her new role. Meanwhile, outgoing Human Resources Minister V. Sivakuma bids farewell to his ministry and apologises to all agencies and officials who dealt with him during his tenure. Party Socialist Malaysia, which is known for championing workers' issues, in a statement today commended the Prime Minister for dropping Sivakuma by saying he is the sole Human Resources Minister it could not work with. On the other side of the political divide, opposition leaders slammed the reshuffle. Past Information Chief Ahmad Fadli Shahari decried alleged double standards in Anwar's number of appointments to the Cabinet, which is 60, up from the previous 55. Fadli also described Anwar's latest Cabinet lineup as a reciprocal Cabinet to repay AMNO's support, and he also predicted that the new Cabinet will only last a year.